Welcome back, everyone. Time now to see what's trending online with our media producer, Bianca Cervantes. She joins us in our news center with more. Bianca. Thanks, Kagan. Today we have a couple of nail biters for the top trending videos online. But before we get into that, the presidential campaign trail makes its way into your smartphone, and privacy is definitely a concern. On the campaign trail, Obama and Romney now provide supporters with apps that help them keep track of campaign activities. But privacy is a concern. The Romney Campaigns app, which allows users to sign in through Facebook, can mine information from the user's friends on the site. The Obama Campaign app plants blue flags at the homes of registered Democrats. Of course I'm concerned. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm very concerned. Yeah, I mean, you did it this morning. You walk up to my door. You knew where I was and you know what it was all about. I have no idea. These apps can also get access to a lot of information from those who download them, like contact lists, friends, telephone numbers. Now, while the Romney campaign declined to comment, the Obama campaign did say this campaign has always and will continue to take great care with the information that people share with us. Caught on dash cam, a terrifying experience for one Iowa woman when her car goes out of control. It was accelerating faster and faster, and I was looking at my GPS, and the number just kept going up and up and up and up. Passing 100, 110, 120 miles per hour, she calls 911. Sheriff's deputies and state troopers tell her to lift the accelerator as she brakes. It slowed down enough that I jumped out, and it kept going, and then the officers went and tracked it down and unhooked the battery. I went and hugged, I don't know what officer it was, but I went and hugged him and I was like, oh my God, I'm safe, I'm safe, I'm safe, I'm safe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. A lion at a Romanian zoo attempts to escape during a room transfer. Tutu became upset after he brushed against the electrified fence. He panicked and tried to climb it. Later, he jumped on the fence and held on to it. Now his handler tried to calm the lion down by talking to him, which worked so there was no need for a tranquilizer. And you can keep up with, it, with what's trending online by downloading our mobile app. That's available for free at KTSM.com. And that's what's trending now for Monday. Live in the News Center, Bianca Cervantes, News Channel 9.